guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name's rachel and i'm really glad that you clicked on this video so it's holiday season with that comes secret santa really close friend rally got me and she gave me an amazing present and i decided to try it out for you guys right here so a few months back there was this huge trend going around on the internet about a washing machine for your beauty blenders and knowing that how much I love makeup and how dirty my brushes get, she got me one and we're gonna try it out for the first time together. So this is the bag. Let's open it. So this is what it looks like. Just like that. You fill it with soap and water and you put your beauty blender in here. But it's so gross. Like, I don't know if you can see, but it's like there's pink on certain spots and there's like my concealer and then my two mini ones are for like powder. So I really want to try to this and see if it would actually work and if not it's great shtick as me and my friends would say if you're interested in trying out a washing machine for a beauty blender then keep on watching let's go and now that we're exposed to the world and we're literally at the most attractive angle possible um let's get started battery time oh do you need a screwdriver i'm gonna go find one yeah, i found a screwdriver that's nice um, look at me being so fancy. Okay, this is not working, so I think I need to find a different one. Guys, this, this video is off to a great start. We're gonna try a flathead screwdriver. Should I beauty guru it? Let's do it. Click that. Oh, this is an opening. Let's see if I can find a third one. I'm gonna try using a nail. Definitely not gonna work. I don't know why I tried that. Oh, I dropped that. Break! I brought pliers. Let's see what happens. I promise I'm not stupid. Like, I actually know how to do things. This isn't working out. I'm back with cuticle cutters. Guys, I'm struggling. Okay, guys, let's go down to the basement. We made it, ladies. Try. Oh. Strapping your seatbelts. It is turning. Just like that. Check to see if it works. Oh. Oh, you hear that? Let me show you guys what it looks like inside with the motor spinning. Just like that. Some soap. It's blue. No name, no label. So, should we just do like that much? I added in the soap. Okay, so it's getting bubbly. Okay, before. Guys, this is really satisfying, not gonna lie. I am I'm impatient. Squeeze it. The pink looks like it's gone. Let's just rinse it off a little bit. Guys, did that work? Honestly, shocked right now. Empty out this gross water. Fill it up halfway. A little squirty squirt. Okay, this one's bigger. Okay. So this is what it looks like beforehand. It's like over here we got dirty, some pink. Does she fit even? Oh, she like kind of doesn't fit. Oh, she's too big. Interesting. Okay, but it kind of starts to clean it. I'm like literally lifting it up by the top. So from what I'm seeing, it's causing a lot of the soap to remain inside the blender. It's not able to hold the full blender because the motor stops because it's too big. There's this spot right there. I don't know if you can tell, but I want to get, oh, I want waste of water. I want to get wipes out. I don't know, maybe it's the beauty blender. I'm going to start a new one on January 1st. I know I'm that person. Let's head back. Final review of the washing machine for the beauty blenders. I would give it a name except the name on the box is literally mini appliances washing machine. It definitely cleans the small beauty blenders really well. But sadly it is not big enough for the actual blenders. This is the Real Technique sponge. I call it beauty blender because at this point that has become the universal name for it. I know that is the name of a product but it's kind of like saying band-aid when you need a bandage. Let's test it. Okay, so it still feels light and airy in my face, so it didn't destroy it. It feels very dense here, which means the soap is still inside. However, I do love this product because, first of all, the person who gave it to me put so much thought behind it, so I really appreciate that. Second of all, I think it's such a cute novelty item. If you love beauty and things like that, then definitely, like, something to add to your collection just for fun, you know. It's just fun to have and fun to listen to, honestly. It's just fun to watch. Like, look at this. That's kind of fun, not, not gonna lie. I, I can be entertained so easily. Though it was not able to handle the big beauty blender, it did clean the small one really well. It is very cute. 
it is a great shtick item, as most of my friends and I would say. And it's just a nice thing to give to someone, which my friends did for me. That is my video. Thank you so much for watching and staying throughout this whole journey. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to join this growing family. Tell everyone you know. Tell the waitresses and the manager at your favorite restaurant. So when they have a break, they can maybe pop on over to the channel. Please let me know any new videos you want to see. I really enjoyed doing this video, so reviews, makeup tutorials, I love. If you haven't seen my last video, go check it out. It'll be linked right here. Thank you for watching, and I know that you'll enjoy my next video. Happy holidays, everyone. Bye.